Can you see her there? Oh, she's not happy because she just dropped an off <laughs> Um We are on the Skyliner. Welcome Getting aboard ready. the Disney Skyliner Thank at you. Disney's Top Century Resort and Disney's Art of Animation Resort. We are on our way to Disney's Caribbean Beach Resort with connecting flights to Disney's Hollywood Studios and Epcot International Gateway. We are on our way to Hollywood Studios and we are going to rock drop. We are now gliding over Hourglass Lake. Please sit back, relax, and enjoy the most magical flight on Earth. Lindsay, you move. <laughs> we're rope dropping, rise of resistance. So we're gonna have a morning in Galaxy's Edge. We're gonna do all the rides, we've got Ogre's Cantina, and then we might go and see Elsa and yeah. Olaf. Yeah. Yeah? So we're gonna see if it's worth rope dropping. Not poppy. Not poppy. We're gonna try and work out if it's worth rope dropping. Rise of resistance. So what I'll also do during during the time that we're in here, we'll check the time as well for the wait for if you just came in, in later in the day. So obviously when I say rock drop for us, that's early magic hours because we're obviously staying on site. So we get in half an hour earlier as well. So we're going to compare it through the day. Okay? So it's now 7.40. Early magic is 8 a.m. Park opens at 8.30, it's already really busy. So Sienna is entertaining everyone with bubbles. 7.50, we're through, and now we're on the march. Wait time, babe. 20 minutes. Well, we might be okay. Scully, Lindsay is just getting Sienna's sneakers on. Sienna, the hack sneaker hack. 40 <laughs> 40. <laughs> Said the wait time was 20 minutes. So if that stays true, we've had a right result. And we're all on together. Yeah. Here we go, so I wasn't going to film walking through, but I'm just mad because we filmed it on the rise in LA, but I'm just mindful if people haven't watched, we'll show you some bits of what's in the line. Here's the guns. Here's the guns, CC. I wonder I'd use one of them on. Lots of costumes. <laughs> Did he have a funny face? You're going to see him again now. Deck is in motion. Recruit crossing to transport. 
no escape. You will tell me the location of the secret base, and then I will destroy you and the resistance. So we're not sure about Tower of Terror then. <laughs> so that was exactly 20 minutes. So that was amazing. So yeah, you probably don't need to check through the rest of the day. That was definitely worth rope dropping and early magic in hours. Um, brilliant. I love that ride. It's so amazing. So well done. It's like three rides in one. Everyone has to ride that ride. It's amazing. So we're coming straight off the Rise of Resistance, straight now to Millennium Falcon. Me and Mummy were just saying, imagine me and Sienna will put us pilots. <laughs> we will be getting to the <laughs> That's a very good point. So literally, we're going to spend the morning here in Star Wars. We've got all the different bits that we're going to do. The three rides, obviously Star Tours just outside. If we're hungry, we might go and get a Ronto's Roaster. Sorry guys, thank you. Um, and then we are at Ogre's Cantina as well later on, so a full Star Wars morning. There's Ro Ronto's Roaster. We'll take the shows in. It's such an amazing area, it's so cool. Does it look good? So just another check, and at 8.39 already, Rise of Resistance is 85 minutes. So if you're staying on site, coming and doing your early hours is definitely worth it. We waited 20 minutes. Oh, hello, my friend. I am Hondo Onaka, and this is Onaka Transport Solutions. Good expedition. You are my fine friend. As we agree, you let us use the ship. We'll get you the supplies you need. You help the You help the resistance, and I get all the profits. Welcome to the Millennium Falcon, Sierra. Welcome to the Heavyweight Record. Wow, look at this, so cool, here we go, 
We've got our pilots in front. The worrying thing is one of these has got to go left and right. Exactly. <laughs> Sienna's a gunner. Here we go. Wow, look at this. Right pilot, push the flashing button to take off. Pilot on the left, move your stick to fly right and left. I was just about to say that. Pilot on the right, pull back on the stick to fly up and pull forward to fly down. Weapons are online. Left pilot, hit the booster. Which means you crash 69%. <laughs> <laughs> so Millennium Falconers, what did you think? Good, I loved it. Sienna, was it good? You were yeah. so brave, sat by yourself. Such a brave she was gunnering. She was firing. Do we think she can do terror, terror? I'm not sure, maybe we'll try startles first. Maybe. We're at 9 a.m. You've done both the Star Wars right. Sorry. Sienna's done both the Star Wars rides and we're now going to go for the classic and go do Star Tours. Don't look too excited, huh? Not look my favourite, it's not my favourite. Look excited, I'm gonna huh? be honest, it's not my favourite. Look excited, huh? Excited! That's better. This is now the line for Rise of Resistance. All the way through there. Oh, we did walk on. 20 minutes. Amazing. We go star tours all three star Wars rides in one day in one hour <laughs> so you could see how excited Lindsay was to ride this uh, and conveniently Sienna fell asleep so it's just me and the co-pilot <laughs> Get herself ready. Yeah. We can't take off. The captain isn't on board. Our takeoff sequence initiated. Uh, 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 excuse me, you don't seem to understand. I am not the captain. I am C3PO. Two one, pilot for takeoff. Contact departure on frequency four two nine. Wait, wait. R two D two. I am not programmed to fly these things. Now just turn us around this instant before we get into trouble. Thank you for joining us. We look forward to seeing 
you on another night. Find it. I love that ride. It's an old one, but I absolutely love it. She loves it that much. She wants to ride again. So is that quiet? We're now back at the front. They get us, let us come all the way back round. Prepare to be boarded, Captain. I'm afraid there's been a terrible mistake. I am seeing. We know you have this rebel spy on board. This is not important. Starkers, this is a restricted area. What are you doing here? I have no idea. On your ship, one loyal to our cause you carry. The spy. <clears throat> Deliver them, you must. Or all will be lost. To your auntie, you. Turn out. He's on Two times. So, Scarlett, all three rides, all three Star Wars rides in one hour. How do you feel? Great. I feel like a Star Wars champion. <laughs> Star Wars champion. <laughs> right, we're going to have to go and meet Chewie. Who do you want to see, Sienna? Chewie. 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 <laughs> so we've never been in here and we're going to go see Darth Vader, Chewbacca and BB-8. This, uh, here we go. Who is it? It's Chewie! <laughs> Do you like him? Sienna, he needs one of the clips like you've got. Yeah? <laughs> we worked really hard to keep our hair organized. Should we get some pictures? Yeah. Oh. Yeah, is he soft? Little funny, huh? So we were going to do Darth Vader, but he's gone to 35 minutes and even BB-8 has gone to 20. She really wanted to see Chewie, so she got to see Chewbacca. Should we go see what else we can find? Change of plan, she wants to watch Dot McStuffins. So we were going to Disney Junior, but we're now going to first aid. Mommy's going to Mommy's going to the doctors, yeah. We've just had a crazy woman in one of the big rented Buena Vista electric vehicle things just ran into Lindsay and crushed her leg in the wall so she's in quite a bit of pain um, she's got a massive egg now on her leg so we're going to go get her checked out hopefully she's okay <laughs> are you alright honey? not funny <laughs> so Lindsay um, may now be renting one of the EVs yeah, from Lake yeah, Buena Vista yeah. Apparently this type of thing happens all the time because people rent the, the EVs, never used them before, have it in fast and then can't control it. Um, but they've been amazing at Disney. So uh, Andrew, who is looking after us, the coordinator, has added some lightning lanes for some rides. Um, the first aid have been amazing with us and they've uh, just given Lindsay some paracetamol and she's just got a razor leg. She's got a right egg on her. That isn't the egg, that's, um, that's ice. <laughs> She hurt her leg. Are you Dot stuff in Sienna? Oh, it's going down, guys. Let's have a look. It's going oh, down. Ooh. What were you going to say, Scarly? Me and Sienna even got presents. Got yeah, Jack even Scar. Sienna and Scarly got presents. You alright, honey? Yeah. She's clearly not feeling too bad. The girls are looking after her. When were they from? Last night? Yeah. Oh, I'm okay, thank you, honey. Go and check if Mummy wants one Dot stuff in. We got one like that. You have it then. <coughs> They good? How's her birthday celebrate her 50th anniversary cookie making you feel? <laughs> so we're out. Gotta say, to be fair, there was absolutely no fault from Disney. 
and Andy the coordinator and then the team Bridget and the rest in the first aid were absolutely phenomenal there weren't they Linz? They really looked after you. Um, and they've also really kindly because they were worried that we've lost some of our day uh, they've added some, um, they're not fast passes anymore, lightning lanes for some of the rides so really really nice. Andrew you were amazing and the rest of the cast at first day. How are you feeling honey? I feel fine, you know me, I just get on with it, just get on with it. She's going to use this as an excuse no, now, isn't she, for alcohol? You were trying to give me a wheelchair, she's like, take the wheelchair, but we've lost the Sienna. We haven't, she's there. No, she's there. But no, I was like, I'll just walk, it's fine, it's fine. It might take us a bit longer. It's longer. It's longer. Definitely needed a stiff alcoholic drink, you know. What did, just just what, did what did I just say? What did I just say? When I went, she's going to use this as an excuse for alcohol. You're like, no, no, I'm fine. I didn't hear the last bit. Mm. I thought you were saying, I'm just going to use it as an excuse. No, I yeah, think right. that we'll need a large drink. Thank you for looking at me. Do you want to go in this scroll? Yeah. Might be good to push it though. To hold on. Somehow, some crazy woman runs into Lindsay and it costs me money to now buy popcorn. How does that work? So the deal is $19 full of popcorn and then apparently every time you want it refilled it's $2.25 for the length of stay, I'm being conned again. So, because we have been at Pop Century and we love it so much, they've chose the Skyliner. There's also the fact that it gets more popcorn in because she was um and arming yesterday about the Mickey one, but they went for the Skyliner but because they thought, are pigs. But, but then we also thought that the popcorn would get stuck and then we're popcorn. Yeah, and will it smell if it's stuck in his feet? Is it good, girls? Uh -huh. Score for Disney popcorn? Ten. You're right, honey. Yeah, I'm fine. So these are the EVs that we're talking about. So people are just renting them. Uh, maybe, but not in all circumstances, Lens. Some people need them, but the, he did. What Andrew was saying was, there's an awful lot of people that are renting them because they don't want to walk. Sheriff Woody here. Hi, Woody. You know what? You're my. Which then means they've no experience of using them, and I definitely got the impression that lady was one of those. Because um, instead of reversing, she then actually came forward and then continued to trap Lindsay's leg in it. <clears throat> She's a trooper. We've said we'll go back to the hotel. She's like, no, no. I'm not flexing it. You sure? We've got plenty more days, we can come back plenty more times. And the so the other thing we noticed with the Skyliner one is you could probably use it as a lunch box. <laughs> oh no, Sienna. Sienna. Oh no. Uh oh. Look at them. Can't look up from a data pad. Can't live without a data pad. Wish I had a data pad. Round to the Falcon. So interestingly, there doesn't seem to be any photo pass people around here. Hmm. You are on?
Oh, he loves, she loves how you chewing. <laughs> Our table is ready at Ogre's Cantina. The most expensive drinks in the galaxy. Here we go. Wow. Flight day celebrations, slime disjoinings. I can turn any space into a hyperspace. So the way it works is we're in a booth and we get 45 minutes and I think you're allowed two drinks. Because you need a mortgage to have two drinks each. So, here's the drinks. Wow. Yeah. Don't spill this one. <laughs> Is it nice? Try yours. Try the chewy drink. Try the chewy drink. Is it nice? Right. Is Scarlet Show's good? Wow, it's really good. How's yours, Linz? Do you remember what it was called? Check out now. No. <laughs> Ash, what have you got? I got the fuzzy Tawan Tawan. Top head. <laughs> Lindsay got, oh god, it does. The, um, the foam on the top. Yeah. The foam on the top could like. Oh wow! So mine was the second one, wasn't it? Yes. Mine was the Jedi mind trick. You went that one. Ashley's is the fuzzy one. Can't try mine. Just wanted to show the table and how it changes colour with the music. That is so cool. Likes him. Now she likes it. <laughs> it's like a Star Wars blueberry. Is it good? I was going to try and drink the popping. Sienna's showing us around. And this is our booth. Did you find all this cantina? Did you like it? Was it fun? Bye guys! Back out into the world. <laughs> did you drink all did you have all the bubble balls? Were they good? Look at that. Straight out into the heat. There's the Falcon. So Scarlet, the only thing left to do now is either build a lightsaber or build a droid. Which do you want to do? Oh! Yeah, right. <laughs> Surprise. Give us 
Back in the backyard. Back in the backyard. So I saw a video on the. Oh, here it is. <laughs> I saw a video on the um, on the Disney TV channel, and from above, you can't really tell from here, but from above, that is a big human uh, footprint. Because obviously we're shrunk down to the size of a toy. So I don't know if you can see it there, but that's a footprint. So we're about to Toy Story Mania. But this one's dozed off. So we're going to go and use some of those amazing um, lightning lanes that Andy gave us. We're going to use rock and roller coasters and Tower of Terror because we're not sure if Sienna would like Tower of Terror. It does feel a bit cruel. Well, she wakes up and we change our mind. How's the leg feeling, Linz? Uh, you sure you don't want to go back? How was it, girls? Yes. Did you do the front row? Yeah. Someone really likes it. I don't know who. Hey, two people. Right. Hey, don't mind us. We'll be finished in just a minute. Hey, yeah. Hey. What? Hey. what do you expect me to do? Send them all with you? Yeah. Hey. Hey. How about some backstage passes? Wait a minute. I love that idea. That's a great idea. How about some backstage passes? Oh, oh. Yeah. Oh. Come on. Yeah. Yeah. Come on. Make it happen. Yeah. Come, Come on. on. Okay. Okay, okay. I'll make it happen. <laughs> Have a good time. to do it now with our lightning passes while Sienna's asleep so we're not going to be the cruel parents to take her on. I actually think she'd probably enjoy it. She probably would. It's but just all the screaming. So no screaming Scarlett. No like all the people. Here we go. So you'll have to compare now when we get off Orlando Tower of Terror or the new Guardians in LA. I'm scared. You need to think about it. <laughs> goofy, you scared me there. He just jumped round the side, that Goofy. Here's Max. Ah, <laughs> we should have had our book. <laughs> well, he likes your ears. This door with the key of imagination. Beyond it is another dimension.
Yeah. How was that, kid? Or you may find yeah, yourself I don't know why I'm so nervous. <laughs> I told you. <laughs> she went, is that it? <laughs> Good? Yeah. How you feeling, kid? I don't know why I was so scared. Was like, it good? Yeah, really good. So, Tower of Terror or Guardians of the Life? Guardians. Really? Yeah. Is it? <laughs> shout him again. Take your dodie out, shout him. He's doing his ears to you. <laughs> He's cheeky up there, isn't he? He's being silly to you. Just Connor's into a Joff Joffrey's donut. Go on then. Pink! Wait a minute. Good? Mm. See how it is, is it good? Good? Yummy. Scoring? No, I love donuts at 10. No, I love donuts at 10. Singing away, now she's awake. So we're going to walk round or hobble for some of us. Uh, to the Toy Story ride, Toy Story Mania, and then we're going to take our time to get over to Boathouse at Disney Springs because obviously you can't get a bus from here, so you've got to go to a hotel. Here we go, Toy Story Mania! Sienna? Whose favourite ever? My favourite ever? <laughs> we do love Toy Story. Funny, if you get in the lightning lane, you don't get to see the potato head. Where you can do that. So the plug's in. So we're going to give Scarlett a lesson on how to get the better scores. We're going to teach her where to find the high scoring bits. Are you ready for your Toy Story lesson? Yeah. Let's go guys! Have a good time girls! Oh, first bit, fast as you can. When you look on the screen, look for anything that's a thousand or more. And then just keep shooting them as much as you can. Like that. Ready? Keep chewing kid, keep chewing! Oh, she's doing so good! Let's examine their score. Oh, Scarlett's a winner! Whoa! Well done, Scarlett! You did amazing! You got a friend in me! You got a friend in me! So this is a brand new uh, Jesse store. It's opened. Apparently, I think it was like last week in August. So obviously, sorry, we're in August and it was last week that it opened. It's very similar to the other Toy Story store in um, Magic Kingdom. Lots of lounge flies. Oh, goodness. I am your robot. <laughs> Socks. Back out into the monkeys. One monkey here. There are lots of monkeys up there. So Saratoga Springs, you get off the Congress Park to go to Disney Springs. Literally, look at that view. Hello. 
You like it? Yeah. Yeah. What? My whistle! I have no idea what you're talking about. No, it's got like Oh, just a minute. There's the Ampi car. It's where we're going now, to the boathouse. There's the boathouse. Lovely table in the middle, nice and aircon. And here is the menu. All looks amazing. So Lindsay's just sat down and dug straight into the bread. Is it good? Nice. So I've tried a mangrove it's called, it's a mango pale ale, it's 8.2%, really tasty and smells amazing, but it's pretty strong. How's the wine honey? Probably my favourite glass of wine. Mm -hmm. And you've got apple juice, the kids get some lovely boathouse cuts. Can I just say one thing that's weird though, the boy in the back is red. Maybe sunburned. So oh, the food has arrived. Me and Lindsay have gone for the filet sliders, which look incredible. Scarlett has gone for the mac and cheese, the French fries, in a, in a car. car. How cool is that? And what is the Sienna has gone for the chicken tenders in a car, in the boat car. It's the boat, like they go in the water. Yeah. Go on then, Linz, give it a try. <laughs> okay, I'll swap you one of yours for one of mine. Just eat, woman. Good. Scully has the mac. I've not tried it yet. Look, yeah, they tried. How are the chips? The, chip, the french fries are incredible. French fries. Really good. You can't have much mac and cheese as it. Good. How's the chicken? Thumbs up. She doesn't like the sauce. So just want to show you these sliders. We had cheese put on them. It is basically a piece of filet steak on two little sliders. Wow. Tim Tracker over here and her, him and Jen came here not long ago actually. Yeah. And she had these sliders and we were watching going, oh my god, oh my that's god. us. We're going. That is us. We actually hadn't got a reservation here in our original plan, so we had to swap everything around to get in because it just looks amazing. Oh, they are so good. I, I ate mine in 60 seconds. <laughs> Did my I literally didn't stop for air. It was yeah, that the movie good. about stealing cars. It's not about that with anything. Lindsay's gone in 60 seconds every time she eats. Dude, it's literally like, oh, 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 I found a little uh, chippy. Mm. <laughs> right. Lindsay Hackett, yes. how would you score the boat house? Well, thanks to uh, Tim and Jen, we chose wisely and went for the sliders, so it's a 10 from me. Scarlet H? Well, so there's oh nothing God. There, there is nothing wrong with it, but in my opinion, it's a 
opinion, I like Disney mac and cheese. You like rubbish mac and cheese, where that was proper made mac and cheese. But so are you going to score it or are you going to be here for a week? But I'm going to give it an 8.5. 8.5? What are you scoring it? Two. Two? Yeah. I'm scoring it a 10 because I thought it was absolutely incredible. And whilst she, she's whinging, their kids' meals were incredible. I can't show you, there's a family next to us who've got the cheeseburgers for the kids, so I'm not Could kidding. Show, show, They're show, show, enormous. Show, show, show. Zoom in on that burger. Zoom in on that kids' cheeseburger. The size of that burger, that's the kids' burger. Incredible. I, I highly recommend the Bolt House. Excuse you. So we've had a delicious meal. But we were going to have a walk around Disney Springs, but Lindsay's leg is killing her. She's done well today, considering. Um, so we're going to have to come back to the hotel. This one is driving us crazy. So there comes the invalid, bless her. Mummy hurt her leg. Mummy's hurt her leg. She's got some medicine. Got some medicine. Off to the pool, we'll see if we can put some different type of ice on it. This is uh, one of the pools, the pool that me and Scarlett came to last night. This is the one that looks like a bowling pin. Around the edges, you've got bowling balls. Hoping no one tries to chuck them in. Right up near our uh, room, this near lady and the tramp. Happy? So we're still in the pool and it's now all lit up. Oh, Scarlett got me some balloons. So I've now got the task of trying to get Scarlett out of this pool and to go back to the room because she does need to wash her hair. If anyone has any tips on how I can do this, that would be greatly appreciated, which doesn't include me dragging her by her feet. Uh oh. So we nearly forgot to finish the vlog, didn't we? <laughs> Mummy and Sienna are fast asleep. You had a good day? Yeah. Done a lot. Mm -hmm. Lindsay's leg is pretty sore. She's got a giant egg on it. She's been around little troop though today. So we're gonna try and get some sleep now. We've got her in some ice, we've got her leg raised. Um so we're gonna finish the vlog here. Scarlett, anything to say? Make sure you like, subscribe and smash that notification bell. Comment down below if you have done more than one Star Wars ride and what Star Wars ride in a day. It's like if you've done like all three Star Wars rides in a day like we did in that hour. But like if you did all three in a day, tell us which ones you did. Or tell us which is your favourite Star Wars ride. Yeah, that's a better one. <laughs> Bye, Bye guys.